Rick and Morty season three episode number two ladies and gentlemen we here to next week's episode of Rick and Morty last week the season three premiere and what a fantastic episode it was man I would say is the best episode of the show thus far man somewhat sad episode or at least what seemed like a sad episode and then things got fucking crazy and then the way we ended it call back to season one I love that Jerry and Beth divorced I think it was kind of official, not 100% sure. Regardless, I'm here for it. I'm excited for it. It seems like season three is going to be some crazy shit. So I'm going to stop wasting time, guys. We're going to go ahead. We're going to hop into this episode. Before we do, I do ask if you guys are new to the channel, you do hit that subscribe button. Comment down below if you guys want to see next man. Drop a like on the video for your boy. For reaction, it'll be up on Patreon as well as early access to the next two episodes. You guys want to check that out. Link in the description down below. But we're going to go ahead. We're going to hop into this episode. <laughs> Hiding in a Calorcan Echo Nest, can you do me a favor and turn your ringer off? It's called Carpe Diem, Morty. Look it up. You look it up. <laughs> you, don't even, you don't even know what it means. That Seize the day. Jerry, I didn't see you there. How much of that did you hear? All of it. You oh, were shit. looking right at me. I just wanted to say goodbye to the kids. Cool, just stay in the driveway. The killbots are live and I took you off the white list. Oh. We'll see you every other weekend, though. Damn, this is really happening. Hi, Dad. Rick, didn't you say you needed my help on an adventure immediately somewhere else? I don't care, even if it might kill us? I did not, but if you're really that alienated, I'm as willing to exploit it as the next guy, church, army, or Olympic gymnastics trainer. <laughs> I'm ready when you are. Bitch, I was ready yesterday. <laughs> hey, Bye. Day. sweetie. I feel bad for Jerry, man. What? <laughs> Hello? I heard that too. <laughs> oh man. Wow, it's actually happening. For some reason, I thought it wasn't going to really happen. Damn. Are they never going to get back together? Is this them kind of writing Jerry off of the show, so to speak? I'm sure he'll be around still. Interesting. Wow. I kind of feel for him, man. <laughs> Dude, I think this one might be my favorite intro so far of the show. Yeah. Morning, Mad Max. The Mohawk guy. They all have Mohawks. Yeah. Oh my God. Oh! Holy shit, summer for the win! I fucking love post-apocalyptic versions of Earth! <laughs> Dude, go ahead, man! Let me find out, summer's doing more than Morty! Your blood will be my lotion. Hit <laughs> my lotion. Damn. Whoa, that was cool. Summer know what she doing. Yeah. <laughs> Summer. Okay, getting darker. Yeah, Summer entering her dark arc, huh? This is so cool, a Mad Max episode, man. We can combine our strength and feast on the weak together. <laughs> what, what, what in the hell are you saying? They don't have to keep trying to kill us if we join them. They're basically pussies. What yeah. is your deal lately? All right, let's get sloppy. Daddy issues for Summer now. We carry it with us for desecration to remind us there are no gods. Kids, weird pitch. Let's have this be our new life. Let's be post-apocalyptic scavengers. Okay. What? Oh my gosh. Chicken fight. <laughs> you see that green rock, Morty? It's about 20 pounds of the stuff I was getting all hard for a flake of. Isotope mm. 322. Well, having a 20 pound boulder of it is better than having a flake. Hey, you guys ever use that Thunderdome or do you just put it up for decoration? Uh, you mean the blood dome? Save it for the semantics dome, E.B. White. Mm. Burn. The important question is, who wants to take a poke at my man Spine Eater here? Oh my gosh. This device extracts and redistributes muscle memory. I'm giving your body a 10-year course in wasteland combat one limb at a time. Oh shit. I'm working with a mixed bag here, so you may not have perfect coordination more. Oh, hey, oh my god. I, I didn't do that. Damn. Okay, this is exciting. It's his left arm too. Oh. Holy oh. shit. Oh. oh my god, dude. One oh. arm 40. Oh. Dude, this guy's single arm is doing this. How the fuck did he die? Used to be Seattle, bro. This is what Seattle looks like, like now. Theme park stunt show, but these guys wear khakis and hockey jerseys. And he wants more! Shit. How long till this thing runs out, or is it permanent? All you had to do go away. Stop standing in the driveway talking about custody. And either tell her you want to stay married or get on with your life. But whatever you do, stop being a baby and act like a man. Damn. That was about his dad. Morty has a dark side we saw in the Purge episode, dude. 
Can I talk to you kids for a second over yonder? Rick, I, I think I'm breaking through to something here. C can we not leave just yet? Leave. I'm not leaving. There is no leave. We are united, or we are enemies. Oh, Ooh. big guy, no, nobody's leaving. Don't be stupid. Uh, I know, why don't we all split up and look for it in groups of three, kids? Mm -hmm. Dude. Oh, we'll be right back. Uh, <laughs> and cut to them running again. Or Rick running by himself. All right, you know what? Fuck it. Damn. My body is chrome. My blood is gasoline. Oh no, my god. Regular blood. Good for the kids. I mean, honestly, I think that they're flourishing. I mean, you'll see when 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 you see them th if that they're you see them. totally flourishing. Yeah. Dude, look at Morty. Booyah! Fuck you, pal. Who else wants some? Who wants to be my pussy of a dad today? <laughs> Oh shit, is this the one that killed him? <laughs> We're just seeing his arm. Shit. What's the matter, you piece of crap? Haven't you ever watched your family burn to death before? <laughs> now I'm gonna whip you. <laughs> Damn. It can't be. It can't be! I was just following orders! I was just following orders! Damn! I'll tell you where my boss lives! Into the castle! Into the castle! Damn! Some Game of Thrones shit. No one has seen my true face and lived. Hmm? Well, I'm not afraid to die. <laughs> and I don't care what you look like. Shut <laughs> your ass up, Summer. Oh. Normal. Huh? I just... I didn't expect you to have a mustache. You hate it. No, I like it. Why don't I just wear a tie, right? I mean, it's like that guy you killed when I met you with the burnt dolls on his body. I hated that guy because why Why are you doing that? Hey, how can you not see how fake that is? And the whole time I'm the same thing. I'm just a fake mess and there's no escaping it because... <laughs> Damn. Yeah, Summer's going through it, bro. Daddy issues. Its benefits are totally, like, less about the food than the emotional nourishment. Uh, okay, weirdo. <laughs> yeah, dial it back, Summer, by 15% and increase dynamic movement by three. Am I right? How's school, Morty? I like school and stuff, kinda. And I'm getting better grades than when you and Dad were, quote mode, staying together for the kids. Quote mode. End quote mode. Quote mode. I like that. <laughs> you millennials. <laughs> Graze my genitals again, Taint Washer, and you'll be shipped to the wasteland. <laughs> and as for you, genital washer. <laughs> Damn. Oh, that was clean. Look, whoever you are, you should know that killing me won't change a thing. L look, man, I'm just along for the ride on this one. So does that mean you'll be going away? Like, does it work like a ghost? Like, is, is this your unfinished business? <laughs> well, kind of. What if we didn't do it? We both got to see our stuff through. I got to deal with my parents' divorce and... You gotta, you know, do what you gotta do. I love you. Oh, eh? fuck. Damn. Rick? Sorry, sorry. I, 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 I can wait for this to wrap up. Damn, he came back. Damn. Handled Maybe the his lesson business. we've learned is that whether it's our parents' marriage, a glowing green rock, or an awesome giant arm, sooner or later, we gotta let it go. Mm -hmm. I don't know if that applies to the throats of murder victims, Morty. Shit! Oh my god. The least I can do. I, I, I owe you this much. See, Morty? Now we're both accountable. <laughs> Damn, dude. Oh my god, look at Summer. Holy shit, she's changed so much. This is a really special thing. You I mean, you can use it to power all your vehicles. You wouldn't be relying on gasoline. You'll be the most advanced tribe of radioactive cannibals in the whole, this version of the world. Three weeks later. <laughs> Damn. It's like the three oh, weeks God earlier tropes from the Hi other there, episode. Summer. How were the ruins today? Oh, you know, Eli. Same shit, different day. Going back to normal society, damn near. Oh, I don't know. I, I didn't mark my murders in my murder log. I didn't know that's how we measured success. Oh, there he is. There's the nihilistic brute I married. Except now life only means nothing when I'm talking to him. And everything means everything when it's on fucking TV. Jesus Christ, when did you become a monster? I was a monster when you met me. We were monsters. We didn't care about anything. I still don't. Yeah, except I'm the only one in this entire world that's still committed to that. Talk about a long setup. Three weeks Rick did this shit for her to come to her own realization. Let's just go home. Coolsies. Damn. Yeah. I'm gonna make him go back to the way they were. You know what? Yeah. 
I think if dad really wanted to be here, he'd stop at nothing to make that happen. Mm. You know, maybe dad just doesn't want you back, or maybe he just doesn't have the strength to fight. In, in either case, he's got his life, I got mine. Yeah. Mm. Hey, who wants to go run in a stream? What the fuck? No. Do, do we have any oranges? I think I got a scurvy ah. coming on. Oh my gosh. Oh god, Summer brought this for him. Everything's bullshit, am I right? Cool. Eh? So, lots of hookers outside, huh? Is that what they are? <laughs> Bro, you know, I can't tell. I'm pretty sure he's just that oblivious, right? <laughs> oh, man. What an episode, dude. Little Mad Max setup. It's so funny to see the second they get the comforts of society, how quick things change. You know what I mean? But to be fair... The way they showed Seattle in this is pretty much what it looks like now. <laughs> Don't come here. Nice doggy. You want a snack? You you want my unemployment check? Hmm? You can tell the difference. And you want this one? But this is actual food. And this would nourish you. And this, it's just paper that only has value to me. <laughs> Unless my suffering is your nourishment. <laughs> Jesus, okay. Yep. Damn. Ran him for his shit. <laughs> Yeah, again. Damn, dude. Boy pulled up and ran him for his shit. Rick and Morty season three, episode two is in the books, ladies and gentlemen. Wow. Mad Max episode. <coughs> Fantastic one at that, dude. Oh, uh, I wasn't sure if they were actually going to go through with the divorce thing. You know, I thought maybe it was going to be the way we just ended the episode and then, you know, they're going to fix their issues. But it looks like this is really what's happening interesting man i'm assuming jerry's still gonna be part of the show and whatnot maybe they'll get back together at some point i don't know maybe they do actually move on we've seen throughout the first two seasons they do have problems in their relationship but who doesn't man regardless evil not evil morty right because there is an actual evil morty out there the dark side of our morty came out this episode dude i know you know the the arm played a part in it too right but the arm was just kind of itself and then morty him talking and stuff wasn't influenced by the arm i don't think it was just him in his own emotions dude and we saw in the purge episode he has that dark side man and it came out again here fucking fantastic stuff i am curious if we're ever gonna see him transform into a car again right i feel like that'll come back at some point but i don't know man summer she's being a part of the adventures more and more which is cool Again, the first season, I feel like she wasn't necessarily in the adventures as much, but it's cool to have her in them too. You know, it adds a, a, a different feel to them, so to speak. But I'm kind of curious as to what Beth's arc is going to be now, right? Now that Jerry's gone, is she going to be involved with them more? Her dad and the kids, is she going to kind of be off in the background more or what? Don't know, but season three is off to a great start. Let me know what you guys thought about it in the comment section down below. Like always, if you guys enjoyed this reaction video, make sure to leave a like if you guys are new to the channel. Hit that subscribe button for reaction to be up on Patreon as well as early access to the next two episodes. You guys want to check that out. Link in the description down below. I hope you all have a wonderful day, and I'll see you in the next one.